What is going on, Ben Nation? The Ben Takeover. It's already started. Uh, you saw reversal in the price action. Of course, you saw a little bit of dip, then it came back up, and now we're kind of ranging in that golden pocket, waiting for that next big move. And you might be asking yourself, if you're just tuning in, what is it that's going on in the Ben Coin verse? And if you haven't seen it so far, uh, it goes a little something like this. But before we unpack it, make sure if you like this type of content, you hit the like button, subscribe button, the bell to be notified of future content. And let's kick this off. All right, guys, as you can see right now, there are Ben BTM machines. They're like ATM machines, but for you to buy Bitcoin or to buy Ben coin at this point, uh, this allows you to buy XRP, a couple other major uh, coins or tokens if you want. And I think it's a fantastic opportunity. And it's just a start of creating this new ability to um, reach a level of mass adoption that you guys deserve. Now, part of this mass adoption piece uh, is that we have to be supportive of what we're doing, these initiatives, things like that. So I encourage you, make sure you share all of these uh, videos. Make sure that you share everything that goes into uh, crafting this BTM machines thing. Uh, go follow. I would I would encourage you to follow at the J Gilmore as well. So that, uh, you know, if content comes out related to Ben, he is, by the way, an early Ben holder. So uh, I would encourage you to go check it out anytime he does something. But also, let's not forget today. Yesterday, Ben was not posting videos in the studio to prepare to launch the new studio. So make sure that you tune in today. There might be a little bit of Ben content in there for the uh, discerning listener, if you will, or viewer, as it may be. Uh, the next generation of live crypto content launches on thursday so there's a lot going on a lot in the background make sure that you tune in for that folks ben armstrong has taken this to a new level so make sure that you're part of it make sure that you're checking it out and then finally let's go look at some price action let's see uh kind of where we are what it looks like uh what is the next move if you will uh and we'll get an idea from the chart we'll do that right now Okay, guys, we're going to go from the one hour to the four hour to the daily chart. I'm going to give you some indications of what you should be looking at and what you should see. So as you can see right now, we did, I mean, basically, we're we're just calling in predicting what's going to happen based on FIB retracement, right? We came down, uh, we touched the 786, moved back up into the 618. Uh, this was last night. Uh, then it came back down. Uh, we're not as low again. If you zoom out a little bit, I think you might find that the trend, which is your friend, that that trend line is starting to show some serious upward momentum. It's about where we bounce off of, right? And we bounce off of this area in this range right here. We bounced down from this range as well, but we came back and did a reversal, uh, building a higher high inside that golden pocket. Now, what we'd be looking for at this point would be something along the lines of a move into uh, this is, by the way, I told you that this would probably happen, then we would reject, and then we come on here, and now we're at the 5.0, which is 72.80, probably a rejection there, you know, bounce around to the same thing, and then move up to the 3.82, but I think the 2.36 is going to be the next move, and that next move is in the 82 range right here. That's what it looks like. Now, if you look at the four hour, and by the way, when you're looking at the money flow, when you're looking at everything, you're looking at it in the positive at this point. Now, when you look at the four hour, which is a longer time frame, you can see that Ben has gone into the green, been sitting in the green now for about seven days. Uh, and the RSI has flipped the signal line. <clears throat> and it would look like we're in a, a, a good scenario for a breakout. Still looking pretty firm here, 82.18. Then on the daily chart, uh, also, you had some red down here. Now, uh, of course, look at that red you see. And you've been dealing with it for a few days now. This 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 red has kind of been out here Um making a mess, if you will, of things by that downward sort of momentum. But it feels like with this green, this, this green um, close and another green close over here, uh, you, you feel like the money flow coming out, but now it's starting to reverse. This is the, the first indicator, big green candle, first indicator of a reversal in the sentiment. Now you can almost, if you pay attention, uh, see that this signal line is coming this way and this is starting to uh, swirl upwards. Now, when it swirls upward, the first time you get that that move uh, that that swirls in the different direction or slows down uh, the 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 negative momentum, if you will, that's when you get one of those pink dots uh, or pink uh, lines. 
letting you know that the reversal is in. Now, the reversal comes in, even a small reversal like this. The last time we got this reversal, if you look, uh, you see here, uh, we kind of broke out of this range here, came up for a test, came back down. Uh, so at the 45, we made a big move up here uh, into the 92 level, right? So if you keep that in mind and you say, well, we're, you know, we're doing the same thing right now, but we're doing it from a different level. Well, then where does that go? Well, this gives you a different narrative and gives you a different story. So if you will, the, the parabolic move went from here to here, from that's the bottom to, to here. So if we assume that's the bottom right here, then we're looking at a breakout to 12.8. Now, I don't think it's going to be that big, but I do think that we're going to have a breakout and drop that zero pretty soon. And all of that started with the machine. But this is not the only announcement. If you remember, Ben made a post saying that this was not the only thing that would be coming this week. And, you know, we're looking forward to whatever it is that comes next. Um, make sure that you're tuning in. Make sure that you're paying attention. Make sure that you're watching. This is not financial advice. My name is Blaze. I'm always right. Thank you so much for tuning in. And we'll talk to you again very, very soon.